Good morning. European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen said yesterday it was imperative for the European Union to address the issue of enlargement as soon as possible to include countries such as Ukraine and Moldova to guarantee they do not fall under the influence of Russia or China. Speaking in Madrid, von der Leyen said the bloc must look forward four years and imagine what the union should be like. Von der Leyen spoke alongside Prime Minister Pedro Sanchez following a meeting of EU commissioners and the government to review Spain's plans for its six-month presidency of the EU Council, which began on Saturday. Von der Leyen said the enlargement issue must be addressed as soon as possible because it will take us time to come to a conclusion. Continued support for Ukraine in its war with Russia was high on the agenda at the meeting and a priority for the Spanish presidency. Sanchez started the presidency on Saturday with a lightning visit to Kiev to underline the bloc's support of Ukraine in the face of the Russian invasion. Catalan police have arrested an Irish man on suspicion of having killed an Irish woman at a hotel in the region. Police say they received a call late on Sunday from the Magnolia Hotel in the coastal resort of Salou, south of Barcelona, informing them a woman had been badly injured. When they arrived at the scene, officers found a woman lying on the floor and a man sitting next to her with self-inflicted wounds. Emergency medical staff were unable to revive the victim and pronounced her dead at the scene. The woman appeared to have been strangled. A man was arrested at the scene. Officers of the region police said he had sustained some injuries. The police later said the arrested man is 30. The woman was 36. The murder suspect is under police guard in hospital in Tarragona. And the leader of the Conservative Popular Party said yesterday that he is open to allowing the far-right party Vox into a governing coalition at national levels. This is the clearest Alberto Núñez Feijó has spoken about the potential for the far-right to become part of a government for the first time in Spain's recent democratic history. Since the right-wing forces scored well in regional and local elections in May, the Popular Party has agreed to govern alongside Vox in the regions of Valencia and Extremadura and several major cities and provinces. In the Balearic Islands, where the Popular Party failed to win a majority, Vox agreed to allow them to govern alone. Just days before the government in Murcia is supposed to be formed, the two parties there have still failed to strike a deal. The Popular Party also fell short of a majority there. The latest survey for El País published yesterday suggests voter support for the right may be fading. That poll suggests that even together the Popular Party and Vox would fall short of a majority government despite winning more support than the two main left-wing parties. That's the latest from TRE. I'm Bob James.